So hey there, it's Crystal with The Traveling Attic. I have been working on this window this weekend. Uh, the window is in. It was a job, to, put, to say the least. If it wasn't for my dad, I would have never made the first cut. <laughs> it was nerve wracking to cut into the van. After doing the window and it actually turned out right, I'm ready to do the fan and I think I can handle it. Um, the fan is square and the window is rounded, which made it even harder. But it is done. We've tested it with a uh, water hose and tried to make it leak and it doesn't leak. So it is in and ready to go. So we got the glass from C.R. Lawrence Automotive Products. Today is a very scary day. I am going to attempt to put the window in the van. And so that means I have to cut a hole in the van. So I'm out here to do everything. And lo and behold, we've left the screws at the apartment. So I'm headed back to get the screws to the window. <laughs> Don't know how I did that. So we're not off to a good start. So, so we're putting up a blanket to catch the shavings. hold this this will break fairly easy if you don't get the pressure directly on top okay all right here we go
we're gonna test it and see if we've done the job correctly. I'm gonna give it a water test. I'm ready. I'm ready. Looking good. Huh? Looking good. It's no. Oh, okay. So I hope you enjoyed this part of the van build, the putting the window in. It is a chore. It is a job. Um, it didn't go as smooth as I thought it would go, but we did in the end get it fixed with the with it waterproofed and everything. So I'm pretty happy with the window, and we're on to the next thing. I hope you enjoy the video. I hope you're subscribed so you can see the, the process that I go through to turn this van into a home. I'll see you on the next video. And I appreciate y'all watching. Thank you. Bye.